I went and I just grabbed a bunch of different screwdrivers. Okay, see all these different tips? Is I'm going to take and do this and I'm going to look up there. Not only did you check to make sure that you could see through it, did you go ahead and verify that it actually is through. The one that we used to take this out I don't think is ideal for this, um, but it is not. You see how it would barely grabbed it? Yeah. Woo, boy, it's a good thing I went really slow, right? Mm -hmm. Could I take this screwdriver and file it down to make it beautiful for this jet? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. how about we do that? How about we go ahead and fix that and fit that up? Let's just try a couple other ones here. So this one. That looks like it's going to be pretty good. Okay, it's, it's not, oh, though, no, isn't it? No, it's See? Not. This is that whole thing, and could you, you know, this, it's a Harley carb. If you're doing Harley work, you're going to have a bunch of these? Yeah. Yeah, go make your screwdriver be done with it, buy the right one. That looks pretty good. Woo, but we just wish it were wider. So remember, mm -hmm. it felt like it fit good, but I just wished it were wider. Yep. Okay, so this is a good one for that. Um, we'll go ahead, uh, just to make a point, and we will grind uh, this one that's already modified. We'll thin this out, make it perfect for this, and pull <coughs> it back into the video. I had this in the disassembly video, but I... I'm reinserting it here. It's just so valuable. If you want to not damage these jets, you really need to make screwdrivers like this for removal and installation. If you like what you see here, would you please share it? I'd love you to keep my platform going here on uh, technical education and uh, um, the ways to be great in your craftsmanship. So keep on wrenching, and we'll see you again in the future. Thanks for being a subscriber and follower of the channel.